My name is Detective Sergeant Wayne Banks of the Toronto Police Homicide Squad and I'm here this afternoon to talk to you about homicide number 29 and that's the murder of Mr. Clayton Wright. Mr. Wright is 42 years of age and is a resident of Mississauga and Toronto. On Tuesday, July the 17th, just after 9.30 p.m., sound of gunshots were heard in the Eglinton Flats near the address of 101 Emmett Avenue in the City of Toronto and that's in number 12 division. This area is a parking lot and also an area of soccer fields. Uh, police officers attended to the 911 calls for the sound of gunshots and located uh, Mr. Wright in the parking lot suffering from a gunshot. Valiant attempts were made to save his life, but unfortunately, Mr. Wright succumbed to his injuries at the scene and was pronounced by EMS through Sunnybrook Hospital. The homicide squad took carriage of this investigation and I can tell you at this point what we know is that Mr. Wright was participating in an adult pickup soccer game at the Eglinton Flats prior to the murder. Uh, about uh, 10 minutes prior to the shooting, he left the soccer game to make his way towards the uh, parking lot area when other patrons and uh, players of the soccer game heard a gunshot. When they came to the parking lot, they located Mr. Wright on the parking lot ground and the 911 calls were placed. Uh, we, as the Toronto Police Homicide Squad, have uh, looked at this investigation and right now I can assure the public uh, and uh, people watching this YouTube video that there is no evidence whatsoever to uh, insinuate that there is any gang affiliation with this murder or any type of gang connection. Our inv investigation to date, uh, we believe that this is an isolated incident. We do not know what the motive is uh, for the senseless tragedy and murder of Mr. Wright. Uh, and we are trying to establish that, but the investigation has shown that there is no gang affiliation uh, or connection to this. Uh, we do not believe that there will be any type of retaliation on this. Again, I believe this is an isolated incident, and uh, you know, obviously we want to find out what the motive was and who the person is that was responsible for this. Our information is that there may have been upwards of 20 to 25 people of both patrons and players that may have been in the parking lot or near the soccer fields. Uh, 12 to 13 of these people remained and made themselves available to speak with the police yesterday. I want to thank those members of the community for coming forward and doing your civic job and assisting the police to find out who's responsible for this murder. I am, however, asking for the public's assistance for anybody that was in the parking lot that didn't speak with the police to please contact the Homicide Squad at 416-808-7400 or to contact Crime Stoppers either through telephone or through the web link uh, that will be attached with this video and please give whatever information you have as well as any of the tenants that may have been on Emmett Avenue that may have been on their balcony uh, during the early evening hours that heard or saw anything to please contact us or to contact Crime Stoppers. Thank you very much.